now we will try to solve a question which is a stay concept and how I am proceeding you have to observe carefully and this question will be very easy. So this is one of uh, one of the simplest questions which uses K concept. So the, let's, uh, let me read this question for you. The ratio of incomes of three friends is in the ratio 3 is to 5 is to 8. This is 3 is to 5 is to 8. If the first person earns rupees 3300, find the sum of the incomes of second and third persons. What does it say? There are three, three friends, A, B, C. Whose, the, whose, uh, the, the ratio of their income is 3 is to 5 is to 8. But the first person here, this is the first person, he earns 3300 rupees. Then the question is asking, find the sum of second and third person, that is B to C. What I told you in the last video is that if the ratio is given, you have to multiply K with every, every, every number that signifies the ratio and you'll find the value. For example, here, here the given data is 3300. What is A's income? A's income is 3K, and in the question it is given 3K equal to 3300. So let's start this way, 3K is equal to 3000, 3300. So we have to find the value of K. Once this K is found out, that means the question is over. The next step, in the next step itself, you can answer the question very promptly. So here, K is 3300 divided by 3. It means 1100 is the value of K. But in the next step, you should be ready to answer the question very promptly. Now let's say, and in this question it is asking, find the sum of incomes of second and third person. Many students do a small mistake in this kind of question. They, they try to find the value of B first, then the value of C, then they add it up because in the question it is asked find the sum of incomes of B and C. So what do they do? The sum of the, the income of B which is 5k, so 5k means 5 into 1100, so this is 5500. Here k was found out to be 1100, so C is 5500. And what is C k? C, C is 8k. 8k means 8800. So they add it up and 003 then 14300 is the sum of incomes of B and C. But this process took a bit, took, took a bit more minutes, more, more seconds and this process is not so right. You directly deal with the question which is asked. For example, here we found out K and the question is asking find the sum of income of second and third person. That means you just find out what is the sum of incomes of B and C directly? So the sum of incomes of B and C is 5K plus 8K is 13K. And here I'm going to multiply 13 into the value of K, which is 1100. And it comes out to be 14300. So this is a straightforward way of solving the question. And uh, now in the next video, I'm going to solve you another question, which is a state concept. Let's see how you can solve it.